So hey what's up guys Harshay and back with another video so guys in this video I'm gonna show you that how you can downgrade or update your device to iOS 12.4 so that you can jailbreak it. So as you probably know that the jailbreak for the iOS 12, 12.4 to be precise has been released. So guys now let me just quickly show you that which iOS I am currently on. So I'll just go in about and guys as you can see this right here is a 12.1.1 version. So guys, I am still on the 12.1.1. So guys, this was the latest software to have jailbreak before the 11. Point, uh, sorry, 12.4. So guys, in this video, I'm going to quickly show you that how you can upgrade or downgrade. So guys, as you can see, I'm currently on the 12.1 version. And guys, even if you are on the 11 uh, iOS 13, that is the beta version, then also you can downgrade it. And if you are below 12.4, then you can upgrade it. So guys, let's just quickly get started. So guys, if you want to know that how to jailbreak your iOS 12.4, then I have a video for the same as well. You can go and check in the uh, check for the links in the description. So guys, for this you need to head over to your computer, and guys, you need to search for this site ipsw.me. I'll leave the links in the description for this site as well. So guys, from here you need to download the IPA file for the iOS, I mean the iPhone 7 or whatever iPhone you are using. So guys, you can select the iPhone which you are using from here. And as you can see, it has all the iPhone listed. So guys, for now, I am using the iPhone 7 GSM. I'll just click on iPhone 7 GSM. And guys, as you can see, the 12.4 iOS is still getting signed. So guys, I'll suggest you guys to do this as soon as possible, as soon as you see the video, because Apple might very soon stop signing the iOS 12.4. Because obviously, guys, the developers at Apple know that the jailbreak for the 12.4 has been released, and they do not want user to jailbreak their iOS device. So guys, anyway, for now, you'll have to download this file. This is a 3.4 gigabyte file. I'm not really sure. I have already downloaded it, so I will not download it again. And guys, now I'll just connect my USB to my uh, laptop. So guys, what you need to do, you need to click on check for update and you need to click hold the shift key and press this button, check for updates. And guys, now, and now I will select for the iOS 12.4 file. Uh, yup, here we go. So guys, as you can see, this right here is the 12.4 file and I'll click on open. So guys, as you can see, this right here now will be extracting the software and this will update your device to the 12.4. So guys, as you can see, I was currently on the 12.1.1 version and guys, I wanted to upgrade as well. So that's why I've selected the file of 12.4. If you don't want to upgrade, I mean, if you are already on the 12.4 version, then you can also download that same file, the 12.4 IPSW uh, IPA file and you can click on upgrade. So guys, I have purposely downloaded the 12.4 file because guys, I wanted to upgrade as well. So now we'll wait again. So this might take a lot of time as well. So guys, I think it's almost time and within a matter of seconds, my iPhone will restart. I suppose so I've been waiting for like 20 minutes for this restore or update so guys uh, let's just wait more and so all right guys finally my device has been upgraded so I am shooting two videos at the same time so guys, that's why I have clicked on restore iPhone not upgrade my uh, not update my iPhone so guys, as you can see so I'll just set up it manually so I let me just quickly set this thing up myself and I'll just show you so guys, as you can see, the entire process is complete right now. So this is what I was talking about. And now I'll just show you the iOS, which I am currently on. I'll just go to about and I'll just check. Uh -oh. And guys, as you can see, the software version is 12.4. So guys, this is how you update or downgrade your device to the iOS 12.4 using very uh, easily, using very simple steps. So you don't need a computer right now. So all of the photos that I had are present on my iOS device. So this means that no data has been deleted from my iOS device. So see you guys, I think that's the first video for this video and if you guys have made till the end, drop a like to this video and most probably you will like this video because you have watched the video till this point. So guys, thank you so much for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one. Till then, peace and subscribe for more jailbreak tutorials and tweaks and hacks and more.